The Rhino Carbon Fibre Concrete Crack Lock is the latest concrete repair product. Use it to reinforce cracks and stop them from spreading. Grind across the surface of the crack, ensuring it's smooth. Lay out the first concrete crack lock as close to the beginning of the crack as possible. Centre the concrete crack lock over the crack and trace the outline. Always lay out the concrete crack locks roughly perpendicular to the crack. Vary the angle slightly to reinforce the crack in all directions. Then place the rhinocarbon fibre crack locks every 200 to 300 millimetres, tracing the web and marking the ends. After clearly marking where each concrete crack lock goes, you're ready to start cutting. Use a suitable tool with a 2mm diamond tip cutting blade. Make the cuts across the crack. Be sure to cut a minimum of 16mm deep. Also be sure the cut is full depth from end to end. Once the cutting is complete, drill holes at the ends with a 13 to 16mm masonry bit ensuring that they're properly spaced to accept the concrete crack locks. Use an industrial vac or other appropriate method to remove all the loose debris and clean out the area. Also, ensure each concrete crack lock fits properly into each area before applying any epoxy. Fill and cut the holes with Dunlop Builders Bond Epoxy. Insert into the cut the stronger than steel Rhino Carbon Fiber Concrete Crack Lock. Apply additional epoxy until it's even with your concrete surface and scrape away any excess epoxy. Apply it elsewhere on the crack or to the next crack lock location. Repeat as necessary. If the epoxy settles in the prepared area, add more to the cuts. Grind excess epoxy with a grinder once it is cured. You can also paint and seal over the repair after everything has dried and been cleaned up. Additional questions? Contact us online at dunloptrade.com.au or call our toll-free customer service line at 1800 222 841.